Hello, welcome to another garden tip. Today you are looking at basil and what I want to show you is centered around nutrient deficiency and we are going to just take a moment to talk about nutrient deficiency in basil and as you know basil uh, can be used for uh, various things some of which I don't know but growing up I know that I use it to make tea and I know that we also use it to make to, to, to season our food right it gives a nice flavor it has a nice taste and all that so this field that you're looking at is basically an, an old field but it is still growing as you can see it has blossoms right okay so I'm going to show you what a normal non-deficient basil leaf looks like and that is exactly what you are looking at now and they are basically green in their appearance now let me show you a, a basil plant or basil leaves that are deficient just to show you the difference okay look at that one there's a big difference there is a big difference very big difference as you can see there is uniform intervenal chlorosis on the leaf surface right so that is basically the difference okay look at this look at this uh, batch of basil right here let us zoom into this one as you can see both older leaves and younger leaves are showing symptoms of nutrient deficiency and based on the the fact that we saw it on the older leaves first we know that it should be magnesium deficiency uh, because magnesium deficiency shows intervenal chlorosis on the older leaves however because the deficiency is not corrected you will find that the entire plant now uh, becomes deficient so you will not only see it on the older leaves you will now see it on the younger leaves as well because there is not sufficient or there isn't enough uh, nutrient or enough magnesium for the plant to sustain itself so you find that the plant shows deficiency in all the leaves so basically you would have to catch the magnesium deficiency from from early stages because of course if you come and see this plant that you are looking at now you are going to say okay magnesium is a is a mobile nutrient you will not see it in the younger leaves however if the plant is not getting enough magnesium you will see it eventually in the younger leaves as well because when 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 the plant exhausts the the, the relocation of magnesium from the older leaves to the younger leaves then there is no more to relocate right so if there is no more to relocate that simply means the younger leaves will not have any magnesium to get so you will find that they will become deficient as well that is the case right here so yes this is nutrient deficiency and we are saying it is magnesium deficiency and you should always strive to spot the deficiency at an early stage before it takes over the entire plant thank you again for stopping by